Hello, this is Line Cook JP from HealthyJunkFood.com with Extra Long Barbecue Cheeseburger. That's right. If you want something extra long, unlike myself, then you've come to the right place. YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, it's your main girl, Julia, back with another. Super official. Recipe. You can't dig it, baby. I know you can't. Hey, listen, man. Here it is, a fried onion ring, right? I can't even. I can't even eat it. All right, guys. We're gonna have to turn this into this. Super official. To start, we're gonna be making beer battered crispy onion rings, and all you're gonna need is a lot of healthy flour, some spices. Was that too quick? Then go here. HealthyJunkFood.com is not affiliated with anyone that sucks. And of course, beer. I only use the finest, Bush Light. And if you don't know what Bush Light is, then uh, you probably have money. Hey, you see what I'm doing here? It's called whisking. Not to be confused with whiskey, that I'm kind of whisking ahead right now. <laughs> oh my god, this is so not funny. This is not funny. So we're just gonna say this has been sitting here for 10 minutes. So we're gonna toss in our onions and get them all soaked up and then we're gonna toss them into some breadcrumbs and then get them covered completely. And we're gonna keep doing this a bunch of times till we get like a lot of onions like this. Heat up a pan with some vegetable oil and fry these guys until golden brown. And fry these guys until golden brown, golden brown. And I forgot to buy paper towels, so we're gonna have to improvise, which is a fancy word for toilet paper. These things are gonna be really greasy when we take them out, so basically like laying on a carpet and then we're putting over like a wire rack. And we're just gonna let the onion rings crisp and drip through the wire rack and come out nice and crispy and good stuff. Burger King, come on, come on, daddy. Come on, what is this? This is looking real weak in the streets right now. Make it at home. Make it as big as you want. And fresh. And one piece instead of two little burgers. A little fun fact about me, Tenderizer. It makes it taste like Burger King. In a good way. So we're going to flame broil this up. BK style. With grill marks. Without flame. I would totally do this on the grill outside, but I don't have a backyard. That actually looks like a steak. And now it doesn't. It's been about three minutes, so time to flip. And there's your authentic Burger King grill marks. Brought to you by the proud Asian guy who doesn't sound Asian because I was purchased by Italians and raised on meatballs, but that's a story for another day. Instead, let's focus on toasting our buns as we prepare for that awesome moment where we assemble the extra long barbecue cheeseburger. Hello? Hey, it's uh, JP from Healthy Junk Food. Who? Uh, JP? Oh yeah, you're that boring, not funny Chinese dude on Dame Drop's channel, right? Well, actually, I'm Korean. That's what I said. Chinese. Hello? Uh, hello? Eh, she's totally into me. Which leads me to introduce you to the son of the son of Baconator. It's just smaller. Pause here for ingredients. I'm so happy to be here! Whee! You're like, Dame, how, how big is this thing? 